Hey guys, Scott from Aristocop.com here. And Seth from Tobacco Advent 2015 here. <laughs> Together, the three of us, we are Markwood Men's Breakfast Club, and welcome back to Tobacco Advent 2015. Hey, I'm from there. <laughs> Day 12, if I recall. Is that right? Yeah. Day 12. Yeah, it is. Let's grab this over here. I was uh, just eating some dark chocolate with almonds. And now I feel like I have dark chocolate with almonds throughout my teeth. All right. Day 12 is from... Jeremy Bloom. Jeremy Bloom. It is the Humidor um, is the company, and it is Battleground is the tobacco. Jeremy will receive his second cornament and his second uh, sticker. Now you That's got to be exciting. Now, might I might I recommend <laughs> putting the sticker on both sides of your phone, <laughs> so no matter which, so no matter which way you pick up your phone, there's us, your 13 favorite YouTube channel. <laughs> yeah, right, it's so, funny. It's funny. Just let it go. So how how long Just. before how long before someone turns this into a phone case? <laughs> <laughs> can't see it happening. No. I mean, it's not one that anyone would want to look at, but... Man, the rain is coming down again. Yeah. Goodness gracious. It's like the 12th, 12th day in the row. Well, 12 days, rainy days of Christmas here. All right. You're striking the wrong end of the match. It doesn't work that way. Mm -mm, it does not. What do we know about Battleground, Nathan? No. Maybe. I don't know. Uh, hang on. We got some notes scattered around here. You got it? No. I don't. Hmm. Let's see. There's a note. No. Oh, no. oh, oh! Battleground! Battleground is from former 310 Pipes and Tobacco. It's not... Why are you yelling? Because of the rain! They can hear us just oh, fine. all right. It's now purchased and produced by the Humidor in Mafreesboro, Tennessee. Drive through there to visit my wife's grandparents. Also... There's a great, um, strong bad email from the website homestarrunner.com, where somebody writes in to home to strong bad from the freeze bro, and he says, "Oh, I like the cut of your jib, and I like the sound of your town. I can't hear the freeze bro, or go through it, or see it without thinking of that. Maybe if somebody's on the ball, we'll link to that video. Homestar Runner, don't count on it." <clears throat> this tobacco is a result of his grandfather's 30 plus years experience and passion for creating the perfect mouth-watering blend of aromatic and English to in English tobaccos. This lush black Cavendish dances with Perique and Latakia to make I'm, this I'm, I'm here to dance. This mild to medium blend is stepping stone worldwide favorite. It's great for both a beginner and experienced smoker who enjoy smoker who enjoy a full bodied smoke. Thank you, Jeremy. Okay. It is that, I can tell you. There is a lot going on there. And uh, it's not all bad. <laughs> okay. So our uh, our question of the day. We got a lot of them in here still. What are the signs of Christmas that re make you realize it's coming soon? The signs of Christmas that make you realize. Uh, Christmas decorations 25% off, usually. So, in July, when they start putting all the Christmas stuff up at Hobby Lobby, that's not a signal to you? Hmm. You know how many 
You know how much time I spent in Hobby Lobby? No. I was in there. I, uh, if you had asked me this three weeks ago, would have been none. None time. Uh, I was actually at Hobby Lobby just the other week. Um, you know how much the Christmas decorations were discounted? 50%. What's the point? In October or November? Uh, this was November. Wow. End of November. Um, the day... <laughs> Quick story. Day after Thanksgiving, my wife, we round up the kids. Um, we are going to Burlington for a uh, nighttime light parade. It's supposed to be awesome. Um, it's been advertised on Piedmont Triad Family or PiedmontParent.com, which is a website that has local events for parents to take their kids to. My wife is so excited because she's going to miss the normal Greensboro Christmas parade. Uh, Burlington is like 40 minutes away to get to this parade. We get down there to downtown, and we're like, we followed our GPS. There's, there's nothing that says, hey, a parade's about to happen in, in 45 minutes. No signs. There's no, Ooh. nothing's been blocked off. We're like, this is weird. We start driving around, and then she realizes that her GPS is taking her to a street, uh, to an intersection that's different from what the website said. The website said it's at Main and 8th Street. Well, there is no intersection at Main and 8th Street, as far as we can tell. Hmm. But we find a different address, so we, and, and it pulls up in the GPS, so we start driving that way. Still, we're like, this is bizarre. Maybe it's on. The, maybe maybe we read the thing wrong. Maybe it's a different night. She gets on there. No, it's this night. What is going on? We can't find anything that says there's a parade going on. Finally, she starts digging around on this website and on the the actual event site, and in like the smallest of small print, it says. Um, Burlington, Iowa. <laughs> she was so upset. So they've got some aggregator that's just grabbing stuff from the internet. I and feeds guess. It, feeds it in there. I guess. She was not happy with this Piedmont parent thing. It's like, it, mm. this is just ridiculous. We, we wasted this time. We drove Good all this way. Uh, no, we, we, we drove all this way. This is a family thing. She was bummed out. So we ended up going to Hobby Lobby afterwards just to kind of get some christmas decorations and um that was just, what a bummer what a bummer because the, the idea sounds great light time parade at night sounds awesome christmas lights but uh yeah so hobby lobby it's the first time i've been there in a year or more had 50 percent off christmas decorations the very end of november crazy uh, what's the point anyway weird well, aside like it's like right. trying to trying to buy a coat this time of year, right? I mean, you can buy a, a, a nice uh, short sleeve shirt. <laughs> yeah, that's right. <laughs> Crazy. Um, for me, signs of Christmas here recently in recent years has been the talk of uh, uh, the International Corn Cob Pipe Month coming to an end, and the start of Tobacco Advent. Hmm. You know, tobacco starting to show up. That's when I yeah. suddenly realize, oh man. The, d the days are uh, the days are short, and I better think about getting some stuff done. Yeah. So, it's a. No, that's, that's true for me. Yeah, I mean, I think I think for me, Thanksgiving is always a sign, too. Yeah, it's, that's a trigger. Right, right after Thanksgiving, we put up the tree and start decorating. Christmas and music and comes the out. Season, yeah. Yeah, I mean, Christmas music tries to force its uh, way into your ears well before that, even before before Halloween this year. That is too soon. Yeah. I think, but uh. I agree. All right, so how about you? When uh, when do you realize what signs of Christmas make you realize that it's coming soon? Answer that in the comments below, and if you're shooting uh, video responses, be sure to link those below as well. And we'll see you again tomorrow for Tobacco Advent Day 13. Thank you. Wow. For the tobacco. Yes. Thank you. <laughs>